All right, so I promised you a video um, feeding one of my trouble feeders, and you'll see she's still pretty tiny. Um, she's actually coming up on a year old here in November, and compared to her litter mate and brother, um, you can see the size difference. He's easily twice her size. Now, he's been eating since day three of being born. I do not wait until they shed to start feeding. Um, a lot of them will start eating after three days of being born, and that was the case with pretty much this entire litter, except for her. Um, she is by far, like, the most problematic feeder that I've had. I've had to force feed her on more than one occasion. Um, but I'm going to show you how I do this. Um, that works, too. Basically, I, I am giving her a fuzzy. This is frozen thawed. Um, I've had, I've tried offering her live before, but... So she's not really striking. She's interested, but she's not striking. So I'll usually tap her on the side to get her to go. There you go. So I tap her on the side of the head, and if that doesn't work, I usually blow like some air in her general direction. And a lot of times if she's not really interested, if I just blow some air on her, that tends to help get her interested. Um, we'll see if she kind of holds on to it, because lately the last couple times I've fed her, she'll strike it and wrap it. Um, and then she won't eat it, so I'm just going to back off and see what she does. 